Good afternoon, my fabulous friends. I hope you're all well. Well, it's the afternoon in the UK, but if you are watching in the USA, it will be early morning. Welcome to the How To Craft Network studio. I hope you're all having a beautiful day. There's lots of you chatting. Today is an extra special show. I cannot wait to get through the show. I have been waiting weeks and weeks and weeks for today's special guest. So if you are watching on YouTube, don't forget to click that subscribe button. There is also a visual share button at the bottom. If you would be so kind enough to click that share button and share the love of craft, that would make me very happy. If you do see a little bell, click the bell. That will give you the half an hour notice every time we are live in studio. Now I have the biggest smile I cannot tell you for today's show. We have a fabulous guest in show. Now you've seen me talking about her over the last coming weeks. I have shown you her fabulous book. And for those of you that don't have it, why not? We all need to read this story. It's a fabulous story. So today we are doing a fabulous show incorporating the fabulous Teresa Collins from the USA. You will all know who she is. And if you don't, we're gonna show you the lovely lady today, a beautiful person inside and out. So I'm gonna say hi. She's all giddy. She's got a big <laughs> smile on her face. Very excited to I'm see so you excited. all. I'm so excited. I by the way i love tony i love tam and oh. i am so grateful to be here so thank you we're just kind of having this vibe going we are we've decided that we're twins yes we're twins absolutely we are twins. and i get you and you get me and we're so in love and passionate about what we do i know so it's... tony and Teresa, we are in the house Yes, and we're ready to rock and roll. We're, Let's just we're do it. We're ready. A, yes, we absolutely are. We've been smiling all morning. Yes. Everything's so yes. exciting. We've been talking about what we're going to do in the future, the plans. Teresa's got it all going on. We're going to talk about it in this yeah. live hour. Let me do a little yes. bit of a shout out. So good afternoon, good morning to hi Helen, hi Kirsty, hi Michaela, hi Tracy, hi Bridget, hi Carol. Let me know about the weather. Hi Karen, hi Enid, Kirsty, Brian. Wendy, Roxy Lee, Tina Smith, Anna Marie, there's lots of you on. I'm running out of breath, but thank you so much for taking the time to come to this afternoon's show. Now, if you are watching on Catch Up, don't worry, the show will be there forever. You're never going to miss the show, and we have some fabulous things going on today, so you'll be able to watch them when you maybe finish work or tomorrow mm -hmm. or at your own leisure. So we are going to be doing a bit of a craft along. It says craft off, but that we felt like that was a bit of a competition. Yeah, I was like, no competition. No. We collaborate. Yes. So we're going to do some crafting together. <gasps> We've no idea what we're really going to do. No. But we're going to show you some of the fabulous items. So let's start off the show with speaking to Teresa. Let's get a little bit about this lovely oh, lady okay. and what she's about. So, Teresa, I am very grateful for you attending the studio. Oh, I cannot grateful. tell you how amazing and oh. incredible it is for you to take time out of your no. busy schedule and come and say hello. So, let's find out a bit okay. about you. So, okay. tell me something about you and your family. Let's start with oh, your beautiful family because I know you've got I, a big one. I have a large family. Yes. It's quite large. Um, I have given birth to five beautiful <laughs> humans. Um, and then I also have a lot of bonus children. And grandchildren. I have a lot of grandchildren, you guys. I have a new one coming next month. <gasps> so babies. excited. I love babies. I love babies. Um, my three daughters alone have eight children under the age of six. Now, you're all asking the question, eight. aren't you? Why eight. does she look like she does? You're all asking the same oh question as I'm thinking. No, no. Right now. No. You know what? I am so happy and grateful for life. Um, I'm a stroke survivor and I lost my, I, I'm basically numb on the left side of my body and I lost my left side peripheral vision with my fifth baby when I was pregnant. I was seven months pregnant and it changed my life. Every day is a gift. I wake up and I don't say, oh, I have to go to work. I have to do this. I say, I get to, I get to do these things. I'm so grateful and being creative is not only something that just fills my soul yes. but also it it means something to me because when I about lost my life and then a couple years after I had my stroke my mother died of a brain aneurysm at the age of 52 you guys and so I just you know I want so desperately to document memories so I'm a memory man mate I'm a memory maker I'm a memory planner I'm a crafter I'm a stamper I'm a DIY girl completely and everything you create is so 
Beautiful. Thank you. So she's getting her samples out, and I'm yeah. like, right, Teresa, yeah. I, I really need to do some work. She's like, let me show you this. I'm like, oh, it's beautiful. Yes. And now I, I can't like, I need to do some work. Like, there's more, there's more. I'm like, oh, I can't look anymore. They're just so gorgeous. I really need to get into this. So if you are brand new, Teresa, there's a little snippet of Teresa's yeah. life. But Teresa also does have a book mm -hmm. of her life story as well. It's an incredible book. Now, lots of you already bought it ahead of Teresa coming to our fabulous studio. So what inspired you to do the book? It takes actually, a lot of courage to do actually, that. Actually, it was something that was presented to me that I never thought I would do. And initially, the book was going to kind of be about like my business and how I grew my business from just a thought and a, you know, to a worldwide brand. I decided that um, in speaking to the publishers, I was like, let, and tell my story, I remember sitting down with him and he goes, wait, 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 we need to tell about you growing up in Hickory, North Carolina and going through extreme, you know, trials and abuse to being such a positive person and basically learning to love yourself despite a lot of hardships and um, rising up every time you felt like, you know, falling down. And so I go through that journey and I talk about it and how I built my business but also how I live my life and how I went through a lot of hard things. And do you think going through those things has made you who you are today? I Absolutely. Think, um, for me, like, I, I always say, like, for me, like, when I lost my vision and, you know, the doctor said it's not going to come back, I said, okay. And instead of being, like, mad and saying, well, why me, why me? I was like, you know what? It's okay. At least I can still see. see yeah. I always like look for the good and the bad. Positive, yeah. And um, I cannot sing. I cannot act. <laughs> I can't, you know, all these things Me I neither. can't do, but I can control my own power. of. And I think one of my powers is positivity. And I work on that. Like I have really worked on that. And that's one of the things that I do with all of my lines and everything I do, whether it's jewelry, I do so many different lifestyle products that because I believe we cannot limit ourselves in what we're going to do. That's just amazing. Yeah. We love you. Oh, we all you. love you. You're very, you're very kind. <laughs> so, um, yeah, so if you are wanting to buy the book, we have some more books loaded on there for you. So check those out. We do have other products as well, which have just been loaded live. Now, I didn't load them early because I felt like they would sell out before we even got to the show. Now, we have no idea what um, Teresa's going to show you. She's just going to talk you through some beautiful samples and some of her products. And she's probably going to throw a little bit of a demo in there and show you yeah. how she works with the products. And I'm going to have a play too. Mm -hmm. Whilst we're doing that, we are going to be ping-ponging questions to each other. I have lots of questions for Teresa. Oh, goodness. And lots of fun ones as well, which she has no idea about, which oh, is gosh. super, super cool. Uh-oh. You know, Tony, before we start, I just have to say, if you get my book today, because I, I know that the power of positivity and the things that we can do, and it's, it was a really vulnerable book to write, but if you get the book um, today while I'm in studio, I would be happy to sign the book for you. So that's Oh, just, my gosh. You, can you sign mine, please? Yes. You but, promise. So just, if, if you would like that. Do not leave without let, signing my book, let Teresa. Us I would love oh, to do that. So Me first, though. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm at the front of the queue. Yes, yeah, so if you do buy this, that's so kind, Teresa. It's going to take you ages. Yeah, there's even pictures in there because I wanted to really let people know, you know, to see that no matter what you face in life, like, you know, we have these labels. Um, and I don't know why I'm sharing this, but I'm going to share it. We have these labels we put on ourselves. And, like, for me, like, I'm a abuse survivor. I'm a stroke survivor. Uh, my husband of 19 years um, was diagnosed with terminal cancer and passed away um, seven years ago. And so I'm a widow. And then I got remarried. And we have all these labels. And sometimes we label ourselves in negative ways. Like, you know, I'm, I'm this. And it's all negative. And I want to reshape the way we label ourselves. Like, I am kind. I am passionate. I can do this. And um, so that's what my book's about. And, I, and so you see the photos They're of my kids. They're just so and, pretty. And it just oh, see, I can you. just see the journey of your family, right from siblings, tiny ones, right yes. through to um, family ones on the sofa where yes. the children have That got... was actually right after I had my stroke and then I had my baby. So that, that picture, I'm looking like, yeah, that was it. Oh, that, that's me. 
I got remarried. This is yes. the lovely Brian, which is yeah. also in studio yeah. today. So Brian yeah. is the lovely husband of Teresa. He's here to support Teresa. Yes. And he's just like Tim, everybody. So if you're wondering <sighs> who Brian is, he is the double of Tim. I'm uh, telling you, it's yes. really crazy how... Yes similar our businesses are how mm -hmm. our worth work ethic is our um, likenesses to the same things our business ethos is this it's crazy i'm not going into too much but it's a little bit crazy and scary as well so this is a fabulous book now i can see a lot of you are saying the book's not there that's probably because it's sold out i do apologize but i will speak to the lovely brian and get some more but if you did buy it, well done, Teresa. Is going to sign it for you. We'll see what we can do moving forwards. So oh my. <laughs> that was fast. Yes. Oh. Wow. So um, what we're going to do is we're going to go and have a look first. I think we need to see Teresa's fabulous, fabulous samples that she's kindly oh brought gosh. on a plane. She oh said gosh. to me, "I was four pounds over. I was going to be four pounds over on the plane. What, yes. do you, what do you get rid of?" Yes. She's like, "I nearly got rid of Brian." <laughs> ah, yeah. Don't tell Brian. Don't tell Brian. <laughs> Don't tell Brian, but she nearly got rid of me to get all box. the stuff on the plane. Yes. So I will do some shouts. I can see a couple of you have got questions. If you have a question for Teresa and you would like to ask, put Q, Q, Q. It will come up as a prompt for me and I will ask Teresa it. Although I have lots of sneaky questions I'm going to drop into Teresa while she shows you some of her fabulous samples because she's got it all going on. So what? what okay. Yeah, show us that one okay. first because that's my so, favourite. So this, th is this your favourite? I think so. Okay. So I don't do know. You want, me, do you want me to hold it up this way or uh, like? Oh, the what? head. Okay. Overhead. Okay, yeah. so this is Christmas Story, and I love Christmas. I love everything to do, and so I just cut out this beautiful, like, shape of the Christmas tree, and you can see the papers. The papers are yummy, and then I just do, you know, like, this was my 31 days of December, um, and every day I was documenting joy. So you can see the washi tape, the, all the papers. Um, and I just, oh, there's there's so much here. The Santa in this line, look at this. Oh, this he's, cute? he's a good Santa, he's, he's so Teresa. Cute. So I just like, look at the papers. So I'm just, wow. And they're a good and quality And by the way, I have well. a thing for gold. You probably, you may well, have figured that out. I did see from your wrist. Yes, your yeah. And look at all these papers. They're, they're just, so yeah, you got, yeah. The Christmas papers so, are yes. available on the website. Yes. Everything Teresa touches is available yes. on the website. I do yes. have codes, but I don't really want to turn yeah. it into a sort of selly, yes. telly show. Yes. The, the, have a look on the website at the products. If I need to bring something up, I will. But let's just have a look and just enjoy what Teresa's brought us So today. the reason why I showed this, it, you know, is because this is just a quick little layout I did. Uh, this is, I have twin grandbabies, so this is Capri, and she's sometimes naughty. So I put here, I said, dear, this is part of the line, dear Santa, define naughty. And on the bottom of my papers, I do little logos so you don't waste anything. And here's our Santa. And I said, because naughty list, and it says, dear Santa, I can explain. Like, how cute is that? And all of my papers, just like double-sided. I always say if, you, if you're not, if you don't um, fancy one side, <gasps> double-sided papers. Like, look at that. Isn't that just, I always like to do collections that, they kind of remind me of like your home, if that makes sense. So, do you so put all these like, on display at home then? I oh. do. My husband doesn't understand it. He's all the time like, can we just like get rid of this? And I'm like, never. <laughs> and I kind of threaten him. I'm like, you cannot. You cannot. Oh. Um, and for me, like this is like, I love, I don't know what it is, but for me, I love cards, but I like trifold. Like, look at this. I... And I have a thing for lifting up, Tony. She's it's just like... We did say pockets and flaps. Pockets and, things, and yeah. flaps. But this line is just... And the thing I love to do is create lines that you would use five years from now. Or never. hoard. Or hoard five yeah, years oh, from now. They never go out of fashion. Yeah, never go out of fashion. And these are my family. You know, this is my oldest daughter, Taylor. And like, that's just so cute. And okay. she's so gorgeous yes. too. You all, you're all oh so gorgeous. Goodness. How do you stay looking so... Uh, no. I, I mean, come on, I look like... Okay, so, and also, a little thing for card makers. Because okay. I know I love making cards, but so when I do my papers, a little tip, even though it's a collage paper, you can cut out every... See, I made this a file folder because I love to make... I, you know, I, I just love paper, and I love to create things. But imagine, I, I deliberately give you enough space in between the images. Tony, I do that on purpose, so that you go, oh... I want to do this. And so, how nice is that? And you've got the numbers. Numbers, So if you yes. want to do, um, like, Absolutely. The, like, elements where you build well, and count down the days. Yes, or an advent, or what, I bet your son 
loves to like count down, right? Yeah, yes. And if they can is. do something and like an advent. So I try to give you everything that you can think of, whether you want to do something like a card or okay. it's, like, it's just a simple top of that. Okay. Me? So I got to show you this one because this is this right here is a so the tag papers okay look you can make a little a card with it like you could make a little um what do you want to call this like a little um you know so like just a like a, ta a brag book or yes. a tag book yes and sometimes i had photos but look i've made this card set who would not love a countdown and then i've made pockets with it little that's a little so pocket. you could put a little bit of money yes. in there Yes, if you've, a gift card. Gift card. Yes, gift cards are so cute. Spend and then it, it closes. And then there's nothing better that I think than putting a photo on it or a gift. I can see I, you like your photos. There's photos yes, on everything. Yes. But it's here's another nice. thing I do. Okay. Okay. So the tags right here. So I don't know about you, but when I do Christmas gifts, so I love my um, backgrounds interior design. So I love to design things. So when you give a package or you give like a gift, I like to take these. And so instead of just looking at it as a tag, I will cut this out and hang it on my presents. Yes. And so, so when I design this line. all the way through. Yeah, this has been one of my best selling lines ever because I love Christmas. You're, like, you're a big Christmas. Well, you're going to have yeah. to with all those grandchildren. Oh. You can't yes. get away from it, can you? I think I'm going to go broke. We have a lot of we have a lot of people in our family. It's, <laughs> it's getting up there. It's getting up there. Right. So that's just uh, I just love everything yes. Teresa's got to say. She's just Aww. an incredible person. So that is the, some of the snippets of the Christmas range. Okay. Yes. There are several other items on there as well. She's got beautiful <gasps> sparkly books. I'll show you yes. them in a small while as well. But what I'm going to do is I'm just going to wing my way back over to the okay. other side, get out of Teresa's space okay. while she just gets organised. I'm just okay. going to talk to you about a couple of other things because I am absolutely going to use my time today to get everything out of Teresa I need to know about her because she's just so, so cool. And she's so fashionable and cool and everything that goes with a great designer so i'm going to hold on to her and keep her here i did say to brian you know you're not going home tomorrow he's like that's fine i like i was joking <laughs> he was like no we will stay stay here in studio so whilst Teresa just gets ready and put some bits and pieces together i'm going to have a plate as well but just so when you are on the website if you are placing an order if you place an order for one item say you've purchased the book okay and you're now thinking oh now i like the papers or oh now I like the rub-ons, just add to previous order. You don't have to pay the postage on every single order. As long as that first order has not left the building, you can add as many orders to that one postage cost as you please. So question, question. I think I've just missed a question there from Carol Clark. It's at the top of the screen. Tony will, oh, I've just, sorry, I've just missed that one. Type it again, sweetheart. I will get back to you. Let's have a look. Positivity from the lovely Teresa. Thank you for taking the time to sign the books. God bless you. Oh, that is so kind. Teresa will sign all the books off. That is yet. Yeah. So if you have ordered the book, you are going to get that signed copy. So thank you so much. So there are lots of different products on there. But I think Teresa's going to do a little bit of snipping. I think, do you want the papers, Alice? Yes. Oh, there you go. It would help. There you go. I was like, so where did the papers go? She's going to just, but do you want, can you just show the pages? Yeah. Because they are double-sided. Oh, a bit I would love cool, to show the cool pages. Not to miss. So um, a little bit about my brand, which I love to educate while I'm here. So if you, even my front cover... I like to give you a little snippet because I will cut these out and make little mini books with these. So, I mean, we could we could stay here for hours and craft you guys because I would love it. So also at the my papers are double sided. So you can see you get double, you know, and then on the bottom of my papers is the season to be grateful and given. So the, I come up with these. And I cut these out and use these for my cards, yep. for my sentiments. And so you're going to get two sheets of each of these lovely, this is Christmas story, like I said. Oh, my goodness. Like, I can just, I can't even tell you how much the colors. And if you are a Teresa Collins fan, let me just tell you something. I use my same colors year after year. And that's why a lot of people love that it's timeless. So what I did on this particular advent, because maybe the colors didn't suit you, so you get 
the countdown, whether, and you could do these in cards, you get them, one side is black and white, and the other side has the color, and this is the one, Dear Santa, I can explain. And, <laughs> you know, sometimes we need to. And who does not love, I have used the Santa in a few lines because I'm kind of addicted to him, but look at this Santa. So I love that you could even cut out each of these individually. And I also have a notebook. It's too good not to give you yes, to me. <laughs> thank you. This is my holiday planner, you guys. It's 84 pages. Can I open it? Of course you can. Okay, so you guys, like this planner is, we we can't keep these in stock because look at this. Okay, you got to see this. It's 84 pages or maybe it's 64. I don't want to lie. But I went through, I designed all of this myself. And so you can, it, it's like holidays to do gift ideas, and you can start this well before. You can actually start it in November. And if you didn't want to, you could just glue these together. That's a little tip. So along the bottom of all the pages is like sentiment and December calendar. And then I go through, so you can then, you can put lists and you can write, you can journal, you can put photos. I, I know I'm going fast, but I get so excited. But look at this. So you can document what's your favorite holiday traditions. The power of writing it down so that you don't forget it is so important. So I got to go back to this one. It's so cute. So 25. So you're going to say, well, wait, there's a lot of blank space. The way, the reason why I did that is I'm going to encourage you to put your photos in this same album. So you're going to journal. You're going to write. What was your Christmas like? What do you look? There is a Christmas countdown page. Or you could just take the pages apart, you guys, and you could use it you know, whatever way. I always say with stickers and washi, I want you to be able to add to it because when at the end of the day, once you have this beautiful book, look at that happy holidays, you're going to be able to decide what do I want in, in my book? May your days be merry and bright. And oh, there's all the reindeer. Um, and so you I, always get those names yes. in a quiz and we never know yes. them, do we? So it, there's Absolutely. the quiz answers. So <laughs> that, that, oh, in the back you can cut out. I did even a die cut page that you could cut this out and put it in your book. So it's just a lot. It, and it's a just a lovely book to carry oh, with you. you. Have you. on your, on your work surface. If you are being creative or you come up with an idea or, oh, I've got to get this gift for that person or that gift. It's a little notebook where you can add those details in. Now I know us in here in the UK don't do it great. We don't do planners very well. We don't do the journaling very well. But I have to say to you, I've been totally inspired this morning. Teresa's brought all of her books where she just writes, snippets of her life, her visuals, her family, um, quotes and things that have inspired her. And I'm telling you, I'm like St. Teresa, I definitely am going to start one of these books. She says, that's amazing. So if you're thinking, do you know what? I'm not sure. Maybe get one of the little books today and maybe just make, start making those notes. They have the washi on there, so you can put the washi on there as well. It's just, it's just amazing. And when Teresa shows you through all of her books where she just writes, you know, uplifting things to herself. She's speaking out loud, aloud, basically. Mm -hmm. So they're a great starting point if it's something that you want to get into. But equally, Teresa has everything from washi to dyes to, to, to everything, to papers, to planners, to journaling, stickers, ephemera, um, and we're going to show you through some of those items as well. So that's sort of a touch on the Christmas stuff. There are lots of things on there. Let's just have a look. Uh, Car Carol Clark. Uh, her to order the book, Teresa, and she Aww. said, thank you so much for taking the time to sign it. Oh, you're so, so welcome. If you are looking for the book, I'm sorry, it, you're all saying you can't find it. That's because it will have sold out. I can't even get my words out. That's because it's probably gone, okay? So if you are papers, if you can't find them, they're probably already sold out, unfortunately. So keep your eyes on the website. Sometimes they do bounce back. I will speak to Teresa and Brian after the show as well. If we can get some more products, we absolutely will. Now, also, Teresa has lots of other collections as well, which are not Christmas related. Yes, Christmas is fabulous, but she also has some pretty papers and collections. In fact, can I give you this? Because uh, yes. I think it's better you talk around it than absolutely. me because it's so pretty. Oh my gosh. I, I'll take these for you. Thank you. I'm like, I'm making a mess and, and I'm, I'm so sorry I'll be the tidier but, um, so this came about is because I love I love warm I love to travel I love anything that has to do with the beach vacation and so this line is all about my love of pink I love it 
And when I designed this line, I called it Tropical Bliss, but it can be really any kind of vacation or pool photos, whatever, you know. Um, I know you call it holiday here. Yes. So when you go on holiday, um, and again, it has these beautiful papers, and it, these are 12 by 12. And you guys, my paper, I just have to say, it's, it's yummy. You, you touch it, double-sided, thick quality. This paper says this is paradise look at this so so i did a, a shrunk down version um also we who doesn't love a, like a luau party so you could like get the paper and just have a luau party or you could say you know what i i love it so what i do for my papers i always try to do double-sided so that you could use some for just any kind of thing but this i love to do this is like you're getting mini cards and when I design this, I, I imagine you could cut these out or you could use elements. You can make cards with those. But then I also have the papers that look at this paper. This may be. What's uh, your favorite color? To, is it, what's uh, your favorite color? You have to tell us I, what your favorite definitely color. Definitely pink. I love. I like pink. I love pink. I love pinks. Are you oh, sure wait, we're not And sisters. I like white and I like gold and I like black. And I like, oh, I love every color. I sure I have my sisters. favorite shades of everything. But this is like, I love this. I love that you could cut out just the flowers. Look at this pink though. The, there's some solid colors. Oh my goodness. And there's a couple different pinks in this line, but look at this, like just so beautiful. And this is a very thick, um, and this one says to travel is to live. So there's some really, I'll kind of get, oh, look at this one. This one again, you may look at this and go, this is too busy. This is too busy. What am I gonna do with this? You can literally, I design my paper so now that you know, you could cut out each of these. Maybe you just want it to say love, best of times, making memories, wander. The time is now. I actually have a book called The Time Is Now, by the way. I wrote a book called The Time Is Now because the best time is the is now, now. Is now. Right and some now. people are knowing that because the, the books and stuff are selling out. But yeah, so the pinks and the, just the vibe is I wanted it to be happy and beautiful but even if you didn't go on um holiday you could use it for other things because there's um papers that are just standard beautiful lovely papers just a beautiful sum yes summer fresh. and you can even hear can you hear how thick that is like that is card oh by the way this is card stock weight paper i like to say that because at home you're probably like okay but you know i love the foundation of creating has to be to me um good good yeah so you're gonna better be, great because, and Teresa says that because she does make a lot of albums yes. and folios so to yes. get those score lines you need good quality cardstock yes. good quality papers that are not going to tear when we put those lines in there now I can see a lot of questions are asking about the papers they're probably gone okay if they're gone I will speak to Teresa and Brian after the show okay uh, some might bounce back so if you can't find them if you are looking for the products that are related to the show and you are watching on the website at the side of the live video where you see me now waving at you, at the side is a button that says shop the show. Click that button and all of the products that are on there will be come up for you that are live in the show. So check those out. However, some products might bounce back. So be patient. Keep checking the website. But it's obviously a first come first serve basis. But I will speak to Teresa and Brian after the show. So that was the beautiful pink collection and we have also complementing items in there as well and I'm just going to quickly show you some of the samples here I have from our lovely design team because when I showed Teresa these today oh by the way design team if you are watching Teresa loves your samples right Teresa I'm beyond love <laughs> she's like taking lots of pictures I'm... and enjoying them inspired inspired so we have these ones here that you can see that's super large it's super huge and not too difficult to cut out, not not hard at all. And then we have, look at these with the washi, complementing washi, just strips of washi down your card. What about just taking some of the components and some of the elements away? As always, incorporate them with the stamps that you have in your collections as well. This is a lovely suitcase from iMala. And then just being really creative, the washi tape really puts a line on it and closes it off for you. So be creative. But as you can see from my little top here, Teresa hasn't seen it because I stole it. But look here. Oh, I, love I it. am enough pin badges. So if you're wanting that lovely pin badge, this is mine. You can't have this. 
but there are other ones on there as well which Teresa has kindly put together I am enough positive and there's a planner girl one on there as well there which is, is a black there one, is. which is quite cool as well so check out the website for all of those things so Teresa can you yeah she's can I it. show something of course you can. okay so one thing that I just decided is because I'm kind of blown away how much stuff is already selling out so thank you I could I'm I'm trying not to cry because then I'm gonna ruin <laughs> my makeup but to thank you and they don't know this but I am going to I have I'm gonna give away five did you see that I nearly dropped okay, all my samples so if you've ordered something today five of you are gonna get a surprise I'm going to give you the Teresa Collins heart pins a sticker set there's like five stickers in here my empowerment buttons I have these wonderful little bag bags that you know can hold your crafts your pencils your pens and I have these lovely totes that are double-sided this one says be you so you, it, it may be a little different assortment but I'm gonna give you five of you are gonna get a gift from me because I I'm blown away and so, Brian, can we make that happen? Ah. He better say yes. Oh, Just, he's giving we're gonna a thumbs up. Okay, we're good. So, five of you, a little gift, an extra gift from me. We will make sure that you get this. But, you guys, rub-ons. <gasps> I have to tell you about rub-ons. They blow my mind. So, I've been doing crafting for so long. I can't tell you how long because then it might tell you my age. I'm just mature. <laughs> yeah, well, let's go there, okay? So, rub-ons, I brought them back. Um, and I just didn't bring them back because rub-ons are not all made the same. So I'm telling you, it will change the way you create with your cards, your everything that you're making. But here's, I should not tell you this, but even go on your skin. I literally put my rub-ons on me to see if they worked. They did. <laughs> Unfortunately, it took two days for them to come off. Not even kidding. So this is just one of the sets I'm going to use. There's four rub-ons right here, okay? This is one set. I have other sets too. But you guys, these are perfect. So they've got little like love, love, love. So these are perfect and these will last forever whether you are, well, I shouldn't say forever, but you, you're you gonna get, you get so much because this, this set right here is 2,460 rub-ons in four sheets because I want you to get value. But I wanna make a little card right now for you, right? So this is how you make how you do rub on. So I'm gonna do, um, oh gosh, I'm gonna do you are limitless because decisions, decisions. you know, decision. And this is lot. Yes, this is a rub on. You're like what, what? And so this is a rub on I've, transfer, I've and got... these are such good quality. So what you do is you just take it off right here. Okay, here we go. Okay, and here we go. And when this is just rubbish, trash. Here we go. And then you put it on your card. And this right here says you are limitless and then it comes with this cute very expensive popsicle <laughs> stick no, I'm, just kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding by the way i think i'm funny and that's something that you may not know about me and i know i'm not but i'm just me i just like to i love to create but i also love to do things that hopefully empower you to go like you know what i am limitless and and i always say this you know because we all get rejected at some time in our life you know, well, even still at my mature age, and I just go, I reject your rejection because I'm working on being the best me. And so this one here, so what you want to do on the rub-ons, you just want to apply it. Um, if you don't have, you know, you know, say you lose this, I've used my credit cards, I've used the back of my pins, and I just give it a really good, but these are, I was so particular. I was like, we are going to make sure these are the best. And by the way, I'm going, you normally don't have to do this as much as I am. But since we're live, I don't want to make a fool of myself, just being honest. But okay, so let's hope it's on there, which it should be. But what you want to do is you just want to slowly, look at this, oh, the magic. Oh my goodness. Look at this. This is magic. Oh, this is magic. How weird magic. Teresa. Okay, see, oh, look. And I missed the last little line here. So this is the great thing about rub-ons, you guys. You put it right back where it was. Right. And then you just go right here. Okay. Oh, of course. Just, do you know, I thought it was going to leave that white ed that like line edge. And it didn't, did it? You're it's, there. It actually You're there. leaves. Okay. So if you could feel this, you guys, it is smooth to the touch. If you saw this right now, it looks like it was printed. Printed. 
It really does. And then you could take the little ones on the little here. I'm just going to keep creating what, with whatever you're doing because you can't stop me now. Have you know? Have you I've heard just that done song a song by Queen? It goes, can't stop me now. Yes. <laughs> yes. Okay, sorry. I've just had a stop. They're never going to invite me back again. They're going to be like, stop. <gasps> I did it straight away. What do you think of it? Be a honest. Absolutely easy. Well, Karen off our design team. Okay. She's put, these are so simple to apply. No strength is needed. Karen suffers with a hands oh, and a joints. So for Karen you. to say that, and I've just done it, and it's just done it so easy. Now I'm going to do another one. I'm doing the so little bit... one that says you are beautiful. Because as a card maker, like these sentiments alone are going to last you like. So I, may, I love to make my own cards with these. Because this one says you are beautiful, because then you you're giving yourself. Will they go on any other surface other yes. than cards? So I I put them on my hands. I put them on. Um, I even have I have some even like, in my but, books. But, will they sit like, on top of the photo? This this, this is good. This is one. Of, this is one of the sets that really? good is a rub on. That's a rub on. Rub on. Oh right. Yes. Um, I put them on plastic. I've labeled stuff. Um, I, I go a little crazy with my rub-ons, but you know, not all rub-ons are created equal. And these are the best I've ever had, the best these. I've ever produced. And um, I'm super proud of these. And I use these, I'm a planner too. So I, if, what would I do without my planner? My planner keeps me very organized, but rub-ons are the perfect thing to use in your planners too. So I'm just gonna, oh, there, easy. And oh. now it just says, you are beautiful at a slant because I did it at a slant, but I love that. And I love it. And then you can like add your other, add your washi, add your die cuts, add your die cut things. But Well, I'm thinking it, you can't add the washi because it's gone. I think everybody's asking about washi now. So, oh, wow. <sighs> um, can I come washi. back? Can <laughs> I come back? This is the best feeling ever. <laughs> so I will have a look after the show, ladies and gents. But See, I, the well, good right there. Tony, the good on that is on, on Be right the here. good. Be the good. Just, I just used the word oh, good. Because you don't have, have to, to use, use them all. You, yes. I'm just using all of the pretty lights. Can light everybody feel the energy? Tony and Teresa, we're like, <gasps> electricity. Teresa, you need to tell. I promise I'm not on drugs, you guys. I promise She's not. I am drinking Coke Zero. She's or not. Coke. It's got vodka in. <laughs> There's no rules in studio. There's no rules. <laughs> so, There's Teresa, no rules. tell us about what tell us about what you've got going on at the moment what's oh, next whilst i'm gosh. loving these rub-ons well, Teresa needs to tell you, know, you what's like, next i so i'm back to doing my keynote speaking um i love that every monday i do i call it mindful um and i do a live every monday on my facebook just like you know kind of what tony is doing and i do that for to just connect and i do that um, every Monday and then I'm all the time debuting new stuff like that I love and do and I do a yearly event and then I love to go teach at people's events so I'm a little bit into that so I do a empowerment box like a subscription yes, you need to tell box. everybody about that because I oh think people would really well, appreciate it. okay that. I was just seeing everybody was doing these subscription boxes and I was looking out there and I was like well what about an empowerment box that actually had like really cool things that reminded you of who you are and enough and and so there's like notebooks and sometimes there's jewelry and there's the, it, every time it's different so I could sit here and say oh I've done you know it could be a hat one time and then so we pack the box full of stuff and we ship it worldwide like literally worldwide people so people in the UK can buy yes it. and we ship it every two months and then if someone goes, you know what, you know, I can't afford it, you know, but for that one month, they can get it the one month. So we don't say you have to do it for a year. And we found that that's been really good because people get it and they go, this is awesome. And then we put so much content in it for such a great price. People love that. And then, um, yeah, and then I'm debuting something today. I'm literally debuting a whole new thing with my company um, to later today. So Just I'm amazing. excited. So yeah. exciting. So, yeah. so as you can see, she's planning ahead all the yes, time. She's got lots of things in the pipeline yeah so i have just, just going back to some of the lovely comments is she really a grandma oh yeah 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 i like i said um my my i love being a grandmother i love it like a lot of people were saying oh you know they can't call you grandma and i'm like or they don't want to be a grandmother and i'm like 
I just feel so blessed, one, to be alive, to see this moment that, um, and I truly, the things that I do, that's why I'm such a avid photo taker. Um, Cause I hear a lot of people saying, well, I don't want to be in the photo. I don't, you know, I don't take photos of myself cause I don't like myself. And um, I, I, I always remind people like your, your weight is not your worth. Your weight is not your worth. And you need to be in the photo. We love you. People love you. And um, you need to love yourself and put yourself in the photo. And so even my notebooks, like I was, just I, I was telling say, Tony, sure. I said, Tony, you've got to like, I have, I literally bring, I write in notebooks. And when I'm inspired by things, I will do things. But I also have a notebook here that has photos. And this happened during COVID. And um, I decided to do, take a regular, this is one of my regular notebooks, you guys. And I literally have, these are just photos of our, our, our grandbabies, you know, when you were FaceTiming. And I print the photos. Like this one says, stay home, stay safe, um, coronavirus worldwide. And this is, was Ezra, my sweet little grandbaby. Oh, he, he's cute. He's cute. And then, the, oh, there's the twins. Um, there's, see, so this is what I do with my, with, because I, I don't just look at a notebook and go, oh, no, I go, oh, this can be, it's because it's really nice quality pages. Um, and there's my son, Zach. He's getting ready to graduate from college next month. I'm so excited. Okay, so Emmy Ann was born during the pandemic, you guys, and I did not get to hold her for, I want to say, maybe eight weeks. Wow. Because of everything. And talk about, like, I want to remember this, so I document it, because I think it's going to be a lesson from gener for generations of how we handle things. And so I just take the photo, print. You can't go back and take the photo. So take the photo, print the photo. Be in your photos and um, and document your life. It's so important because I really feel like the time is now to start living, not waiting and um, make the plans, you know? Yeah, it's it's a tough one, isn't it? Because sometimes I, I get, totally get where Teresa's coming from. You don't want to be in the photo. And no. It, it, sometimes you have to listen to somebody else to appreciate or realize that, you know, yeah, get in those photos. Life is for living. Life yes. is there. And I say this to you yes. all the time, ladies and gents, on yes. my life most days. Um, and Teresa's of the same ethos as me, you know, life is absolutely for living. Let's enjoy it. Let's enjoy the love of craft. And if craft is what's keeping you going, then so be it. Let's be creative with what we love to do. So let's have a look. Uh, Latricia is from the USA, um, Teresa, and she's bought your products from HSN. Oh. So yes. Teresa's also been on HSN yes, as well. Yes, so yes, Teresa's yes. been Thank a, you. Thank in you. In a kind way, Teresa has absolutely been around the block. She knows oh, the yes. industry inside yes. and out. Yes. There's not much that she doesn't um, know at all. So whilst you're flicking, I'm just going to, I've got a few, I said I was going to spruce it up a little bit, didn't I? So I have a few things to pick oh, over to Teresa, just for a little bit of fun. Because okay. We okay. will still continue to talk about product and that, okay. but it's, we all want to know about Teresa, don't we? I've got a little bit of a list going on here. Okay. So, some um, things we say in the UK. So, okay. do you say scone or scone? Well, okay. <laughs> I would say scone. Did I say, I think I created a third version because I'm from the South in the United States. So, I said scone. 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 I sound like you. Scone. That sounds really good, though. Scone sounds good. Potato or patata? Potato. 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 <laughs> she made See? a I'm made southern. A southern. I'm southern. My she husband would say it different than me. Okay. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Water or water? Okay, definitely water. 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 How does everybody else say it at home? Water uh, in uh, Yorkshire? Probably most of you will yes. hear me say water. Yes. Okay, so in the UK, okay. when we're really giddy, we all say, well, I say, oh, I'm a giddy kipper. What do you say? I'm like, oh, so when, when like you're really excited, excited about, you know. Oh, my gosh. I'm like, what would we say? We'd probably uh, say, <laughs> I'm so excited. You just say, I'm so excited. Yeah, I'm so excited. Or like, yes, yes, yes. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So yeah. no, no particular... Somebody once on here said when they were excited that they'd flipped a noodle. 
Oh. So I started saying it, thinking, oh, it must, oh, yeah. be, it must be a USA thing, but everybody will like it, so I, not. No. It's, somebody's no. done that as a trick. <laughs> no, I think now that it would be kind of like, yes, yes, get yes. in. So let's have a look what else I've got on the list. So, okay. Chocolate or peanut butter? Oh, easy. Chocolate, peanut butter, no for me. You like no. chocolate? Mm -hmm. So we all know what treats to buy yeah. Teresa when she comes. Yeah. Ice cream or cheese? Ice cream. Not even ice cream. How can always? That's my vice. Ice cream. Mm, okay. Ice cream. So when we go out in the UK and we say we're going out for a boogie, a dance. Oh, okay. What do you say? Um, if you're going to a place where you could have a little bit of a dance, okay. would we say we're going for a boogie. I would say you're you're we're going to the club. You're going, going to, to the club, club right? A, to do the square, to do the yeah. But you're asking a more mature person. If you're on here and you're a lot younger, tell me if I'm just way wrong. What would you say? <laughs> so, Tariq, what's your ideal evening? <gasps> Ooh, okay. So my husband cooks for me pretty much every night. And there's a reason. <laughs> he's a better cook than me and, and I, I burn things. It's bad. But he's a great cook and he loves to cook. And that's his love language. So... So we'll have dinner, and then he'll always say, are you done working? Are you done? Because I love it. I love to keep designing. And then we pick shows, like something. It could be on Netflix, Hulu, and we get we watch that one show, and we give it like a couple, you know, a couple episodes. Do we like it? Do we not? And if we like it, we binge watch it. It's a problem. That's what we'll do in the evening. It's bad. It's bad. I think some of our viewers have got binge problems. Yes. You know, when something's yes. really good, like I watched it yes. all in one yes. rather than breaking so it up. We'll, but of course you have to go to bed, so we'll watch a couple. And then the next night, if we can, we'll, we just keep watching that same series that's over. Okay. The list, I have a big list here. I was like, we'll just keep going until we get, you know, we run out of steam. Okay. So the next one okay. is, what's your favorite drink? Oh, okay. Back in the States, it's called Diet Mountain Dew. I love it. And I put like a little, um, is, is it alcohol? Powder. Um, no, it's not alcohol. Right. Can you imagine me with alcohol? It could mm. be, it could be pretty bad, but <laughs> I love that. Um, I love like, but I'm a fruity kind of pina colada girl. Though. Okay. Pina coladas, those kind of drinks are like, you know, beach, take me to a beach. I love that kind of thing. Okay. Yeah. So that's all about food. Okay. <laughs> food. Let's move away from food. Okay. Okay. Let's let's ask about you and your lifestyle then. Okay. So when do you feel like you're more productive? Like for me, I'm Ooh. more productive first thing on a morning. Yes. Straight on it. Yes. What? When do you find you? You know, you do your best pieces of work. You know, probably in the morning. But um, it's kind of crazy because because I like to write books and do things like that. I kind of find in the evening for me on that. Really? Like, so it's kind of different. I'm not a napper, so I just kind of go all day. But, yeah, definitely. But when do you create, Tony? I need to know. Like, are you a nighttime creator or morning? Morning. <gasps> really? I'm both. So as soon as I pick but, my son up from school, I, I tend night. to try and shut off, although I'm still yes. working at home. Okay. I tend to shut off from um, the everyday life because I then have to turn into okay. a mum, although I still work. But yes. when I'm at my desk, first thing on the morning, yes. straight in work, boom, 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 okay. boom. Okay. Okay. Straight into it. Yes. It lasts for about half an hour. I'm all joking. Yeah. <laughs> it lasts all day until I get my son. Yeah. So I would like, I've got a lovely one on here, actually, Teresa. So um, there's so many on here. I'm trying to just pick the best ones at the moment. Ooh. So what? What inspired, I'll, I'll leave this one with you and then I'm going to get some more okay. bits and pieces out because there's people asking about products. So, okay, okay. What inspires you? What, what makes you do what you do and love the most? What inspires oh you? Oh my gosh. I know there's I, so many I, things. Honestly, a lot of what inspires me in life is the people I'm meeting and connecting with because I want to tell a story and I want to help other people tell their story through, through whether it's a t-shirt that they go, I'm telling my story that I want to feel this way or, you know, or rub-ons. Like, literally, I was like, how can someone, you know, it inspires me. And, like, when I meet people and they share their story with me, and we talked about this, Tony, um, because I'm a sharer and I think other people know that I love to hear their story too because, you know, 
um, it inspires me to keep going. But I'll be honest, there's nothing like just walking around and looking at the world. That is, you know, I look and I'll look at something, I go, oh, that's so pretty. And it's not a creative yeah. thing other than just going, oh, I love that color. Oh, I love this moment. And wanting to document that moment helps me. Yeah, it helps me too. We're, we're, we're so similar. Can I just pass yes. you all these, Teresa? Because <gasps> oh, I think the girls yes. will love okay, your little Okay, so little this, mini. okay, can I share why this came about? So these are the cute little notebooks. So this came about because I was traveling so much. I said, I need, this is passport size. Yes. Okay, so this is, I call this the passport notebook size. And so you get three of them, okay? But... I was like, okay, we got to have the sparkly, we got to have the empowerment, we got to have some little leopard, but they're all different. So this is like the dots, oh. and this one is the line, and this one is, you guessed it, the graph. So that if you're a bullet journal or, or you whatever, because how many times have you been, or you put this in your purse and you can write down notes, and three is better than one. So the same thing with this one that says, I am enough. So I do an empowerment one, and this one is the line paper, and then the gold. And by the way, the gold does not come off. Like, look at this, like, high-quality graph. Like, I've actually done complete books with this, and I love... I, Did you have uh, a sparkly one? I think you had. Yes, you showed me a sparkly yes, one, Teresa. I have it's sparkles. Oh, yeah. I yours, have the silver Okay, book. so i got to show you this because we have regular size, too. So this is... I was showing this to you because I didn't think I was going to show it on air, but I'm going to show it. It's so heavily loved. But this is a, um, this is my empowerment. This is one I created just for myself to remind myself, like, how big is your brave? Fear is temporary. Regret is forever. And this is my, I mean, I'm kind of embarrassed to be showing you this because it's so loved. And I look at it and I write things in it. Like, be the girl who decided to go for it. Follow your heart. And then these are just all of my, this is Teresa Collins, like stickers and washi. And I, you know, don't think small. Um, her, you know, and I just journal and I write, this is completely for me, you know. And I just, you know, for example, the greatest things you can learn from trials are, one, what matters, two, who matters. Three, why it matters. And um, I, I believe so strongly in the power of our mindset. And so I use my products in every way possible to build myself and to help others. Like these little cute little stickers or just, you know, so I just, you know. They're just amazing, yeah, aren't they? So Can I just pass you these as absolutely. well? Absolutely. Uh, not that I just want <gasps> you to show everything. Yes. Can okay. you show how they work? Okay, because if you just see these, you think, oh, there's some stickers. But there's 540 stickers in this set. And they okay? all go with the books, don't they? Yes. And so i got to show this because I always say value, value, value. How can I give value to what I'm doing? So I'm just going to pull these out. So this particular one is called Tropical Bliss, okay? So you're going to look at it, and you may look. And so there's the alphabets and then just icons. But look at this. You get my alpha sheets. So even if you want to just, you I'm know. pink. Yes, pink. <laughs> and then all these little things to do. Love this moment. You get numbers. You get, oh, that, that went back with the alphabet. So you get A to Z and more. Then the mini. You go, these are clear. These are clear, transparency, alphabet, and numbers, the months of the year. Like, I'm about value, value. And then, look at this. You also get three separate, and the gold foil here is not that it's beautiful. brassy. It is so gorgeous. You get all of these. This is all in one pack, you guys. And then this one, these are clear, too. So you can't really see it because it looks like it would be white, but there's nothing like as cute that's clear. Look at that. Clear. And um, I absolutely love these for my cards, for my projects, for everything I use. Um, I'll be, it's one of those things that um, I'll use even like for my grandkids like to come over and craft. And so we'll do personal projects for them. They love to do. So you get all of these. Every so, single so one of these. Incredible value. Too. Yes. So you get all of these sheets. So All I've got in one pack. a lady here saying um, they're going to use get the books and use them for uni, yes. university, and I then we have 
Somebody's put Susan's put. I seem to recall Teresa used to make her own stamps. Yes. And um, these were kits in a box. Is that still the case? Okay, so you're thinking of the Teresa Collins stamp maker. Yes, yes, yes. I did that. And I still love, I still, I, I hope they're still around. I know they are. They should be. And they're located here in the UK. Yes. So the stamp maker, yes, love them. Still love everything they're doing. And then I also produce my own already made stamps as well. So yes. yes. There are some of yes. Teresa's stamps on the website right now, which complement the lovely paper pad that she's got with that super large flower hibiscus on there. Mm -hmm. So let's have a look. So I've got a question. Okay. Helen Priestley, question, question. What's the one crafty item you couldn't live without? Oh, Helen, that's like asking my favorite child. Helen, <laughs> why are you doing this to me? Uh, okay, I can't, okay. <sighs> what? I love everything. Oh, goodness. Okay, you're going to think this is crazy, but I'm just going to say it because my pen. Because I have to write from my heart. <laughs> I, I have to, I, when I create a project, a card, I'm going to write a letter to you. So girls who, or boys who got my, my book today, I will write to you. Um, and that's going to be the safe way because. Stick to the pen. I'll stick to the pen. Stick even to though the pen. That's just, yeah. So to the, the, just going back, we're getting questions now about the um, giveaway. Ooh. So Teresa's just said that she's going to give five people, five lucky winners, a yep. giveaway. All you need to do to be in with a chance to win those giveaways is pop a comment underneath this live mm -hmm. about um, anything really, about have you yeah. enjoyed the show or things like that. Mm -hmm. And you're going to get all of those mm -hmm. lovely, lovely items that Teresa showed you mm -hmm. earlier. Now you can go back and watch previously as well. Oh, have we got more questions? Oh, we've got lots. Oh. Oh, Teresa's favorite child. No, that's we can't ask that question. Oh, because my gosh. they may be. Are watching. you sure that's not my child asking? It, well, who, who asked that? No, who it's asked? not. It's Enid. Don't okay. worry. I know this lady. She lives around the corner. <laughs> Enid. <laughs> so, do we have a new book on the way? Um, I'm with... working on one right now. Um, and yes, yes. That's all she's saying. Yes. Yes. Um, I need, um, the book hasn't sold out. We've got a few left, but we're, we're, we're holding on to them till the end of the show. Uh, I'll talk to you a bit about that one. Oh, um, okay. So to win, pop a comment underneath this live. We'll pick five winners. So it's not just one. Theresa's doing five. So there's so much opportunity to get involved. Pop a comment underneath about the show. Right. Theresa, do you want to come to this side? Yes. Come and stand yes. with me. Yes, okay, I'm coming. Come, I took come, my, come. my heels off. I was a little bit taller, so. Uh, <laughs> so I've got a couple of things just okay. to oh, talk about before. I know so I did beautiful. a good job, didn't I? You um, did a great job. Those robots are just like. You can't even tell. No, you really can't. I if, have to tell people that they're robots. Top tip today, get the robots, ladies and gents. Yes. You really need the robots. Thank you so much for joining us. However, I do have a couple of other things that I want to talk about before we close play. So as you all know, Teresa has her own YouTube channel. Facebook platforms and things like that. But Teresa's got this amazing um, subscription and empowerment yes. box and thing going on. Can yes. you just explain? Because I think people will really oh, want to okay. tune in to so what you've got going what on. What it is, is every two months I do, and I theme it. So there's like, it could be like your love box or whatever. And so they get the box and yep. it's beautiful. It's Teresa Collins and you open it up. And I even see some people here that actually get the box. So leave some comments, share about it. Um, and they open it up and they don't know what they're going to get, yep. but it could be, you know, empowerment buttons. It could be, we put literally over, over well over a hundred dollars worth of us into a box and do it up far less. Cause it's really about me filling someone's you know, bucket, their love. And so we change it up. And so at least once a year, we do like an actual really nice t-shirt, like I am enough. Um, we have our next box is going to be next month and it is out of this world. So we've been doing a lot of exclusive stuff that you can yep. only get if you get the box. And so um, I just, you probably don't know this, but I just came out with a line of Teresa Collins beauty products. So and it's, I've got lotions and, and well, actually they sold out, but I, there's a lot of stuff that were kind of sold out, but I have, I have massage oils and face serums and just so many different things that were my favorite things that I couldn't find. So, um, we put a lot of that in my empowerment box because I want 
everyone to like get the chance to like just feel pampered and feel like oh, I got this and I have so many people they'll say like I um I gave this to my daughter as a gift or I gave this to great gift ideas. Yes, it's it? great gift ideas and so it's always an assortment of like really beautiful products that will make you happy too. We've like got some ladies commenting now Aww. every subscription box that is as if Teresa yes. created it just for me. Oh, thank you, Karen. I appreciate that. And that's and that's what I want. I want people to feel like inspired and that they go, oh, I can do this. And just, you know, a box of positivity, basically. Absolutely. I mean, who doesn't love Teresa? You're, you're, so you're so sweet. You're so sweet. I mean, I'm feeling empowered myself, and we've only had like a couple of hours together. I'm feeling great about myself. I'm already going to get those books, and I'm going to be writing some notes down. Yes. Those little passport mini ones, I'm going to be writing bits and pieces yes. in there when I'm at TV and I'm sat in that green room thinking about things and things like that. So, I want, <sighs> there's so much. I have to just ask you one okay. more thing. Out okay. of all the things that you've ever created, what is the, what what thing are you most proud of or the most successful thing where you think i knew that was going to happen i worked so hard at it what was it tell me tell me because i would probably say for me mine okay. would be something like my um, first inclination on. was my kids when you just said what was my thing i'm most proud of something that is my kids of course Not that i want to cry but um after that i would have to say like in the creative world like um Gosh, it might have to be, I can't even, maybe so my, there's so many things that I've done that, which is because, you know, I remember going, maybe one of the things would be debut in my apparel line that was very positive and jewelry and stuff, because when people can wear it and not only can you like, cause it's one thing I love what I'm doing, but they can show it to the world. And like, I've had people stop me and they'd go, where did you get your I am enough sweatshirt? And I go, uh, and my husband goes, you can go to her website, you know, or, and, and it really made me proud that like people took notice. Yeah. Just that really helps me to like, know that like, and probably my book too, because it yeah, was really definitely. hard to do it, but I knew that I was giving by sharing my heart that I was able to help other people know like, hey, I can get through this. I'm going to get through this. And um, I didn't, it's not one of those books where, you know how some people, they write books or they, and it's like so surface level. I'm like, no, we're going to go deep. We're going to go real. I'm going to share literally how, you know, because I have a morning routine. I have a night routine to, I say, if I don't feel good about myself, how can I present myself to the world? You know, like, so I have to build myself. I say we either build ourselves or we break ourselves every day. And my job is to build myself and build others. And hopefully that's through kindness and serving and doing these things. And so my products are just such a, they're just my children. It, you know, I love it. Um, and I want people to feel that when they use it. Like they look at it, I want them to, you know why I did this? I have to show you. You know why this rub on right here? These rub ons are so cute. The reason why I did this line is I'm a Leo and I go, we have to remember our strength. You know, so when I do something, you may look at or like, you know, I'm like, we are beautiful, you know, yeah. you know, and so I can look at things. And so it's very personal. It's not just like, oh, throw a lion on there. It's no, it's, it's, it's there for a reason. And it means I something. will be strong, you yes. know, and so there is keep going, keep going. I did it three times because when my husband passed away, I was so devastated. And I was like, how can I take something that has made me feel like. I can't go on and turn my message, my mess into like a message, you know, yeah. and like, how can I do that? And there'll be so many other people, not just in the craft industry, but in lots of other sort of areas who've been through similar. Yes. We all have, we all have hard. We cannot compare our hard. No. Like Tony, your hard is hard. Mm -hmm. And just because maybe you haven't done, been through something someone else has, or me, we don't compare our hard. We just, we just want to connect with each other and help each other during our hard times. And that's what it's about. And I realized this a few years ago, when we're going through our hard things in life, I really think, I say our struggles um, really strengthen us. Your struggles strengthen you. And 
but they also need to help other people because when other people go through that journey and they're lost and they're afraid and they're like, how am I going to get through this? You can maybe say, you know, I've went through this. I, I, I see you. Let me, let me help you. Yeah. And that's kind of like what I want to do with not only my books, but my, my whole life. And that's, I never thought I would be going around the world speaking to, I mean, not just craft groups, not just planner groups. I mean, I'm speaking at colleges and things that I never thought they would say, can you come speak to us? Because the power of your story is so important. So make sure that you're sharing your story and sharing who you are with other people, because I believe we're here to connect and to celebrate each other, not to compete, you know, and but the world wants us to compete. They, they want us to say like, your success takes away from my success. Absolutely not. Um, and so Every one of my products and everything I do is focused on building. And like I'm looking at this rub on right here, it says, you are magic, you know, and that is me to the core. And, you know, I, I, I just believe in the, in the power of positivity. And if that's just how it is. Just amazing. Oh, you're so sweet. I'm you're feeling sweet. so. You're the same way. I'm feeling on top of the world. Huh? Hey, hey, everybody's hey. on top of the world. Thank you so much, everyone. Before we go, though, I want to bring in Brian. What? My cute husband? I call him Mr. Cute Husband. Okay, come over because here, Brian. I want Brian to come and say hello because oh, oh, oh. he is a force. He is part of yeah. Yeah. Teresa. Back of this oh. studio. Teresa Collins brand, who also looks after Teresa incredibly well as I well. Try. He tries. <laughs> so you try. I want to say thank you to you both. Oh, well, thank goodness, you for inviting thank us. Thank you. Amazing. We have I had cannot. such, we, we love it. We love it here. You should see their studio here. Their production is here. Like, Tony and Tim. You put a lot of pressure on me when we go home to our game. I did. Studio. I said, Brian, come on. Let, let's, <laughs> we got to do this. <laughs> but yeah. You've got to step up, Brian. You yeah. Isn't he cute? Yeah. He's, well, thank you so much. Yes. We no, do appreciate you your time, thank you. your love, your passion. It's 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 just captivating i'm gonna learn so much from you Therese. i'm gonna take it away with me and i'm gonna share that with my fabulous friends and crafters as well cannot thank you enough so whatever you're doing this evening this afternoon stay safe cozy have a beautiful afternoon and if you are crafting have a great time bye, don't forget to pop a comment for those five giveaways i'll see you all later bye, bye. bye.